New tonight, shocking video from a shooting at a gas station in Theodore. An army veteran now in the hospital and the shooter is still out there. Our Tyler fingered live in Mobile tonight with a video and Tyler, you spoke with the victim's family. Yeah, hey, good evening, Lenise. I did. The family wants answers tonight, and they're hoping that the video is able to track down that shooter. I do want to warn you, some of this video might be considered disturbing to some. It was a close call at a gas station on Highway 90 early Thursday morning. A Jeep being driven by James Isom nearly hitting a silver sedan. That's when police say words were exchanged. Isom then drove off. The silver sedan following close behind. Isom's family says near one of the exits, Isom got out of his car along with someone from the other vehicle and was shot. He made a mistake coming that close to their vehicle. It happens all the time. That's not enough to try and end someone's life over. The shooting happened at the mobile at the intersection of Highway 90 and Bellingrath Road. In the video the gas station provided, you can see Isom on the ground for a few moments after being shot before he gets up and drives home. His wife says he didn't realize he was shot in the abdomen until hours later. He's in a lot of pain. He uh, the bullet did a lot of damage. He's got a very, very long road ahead of him. He's got at least two more surgeries coming up. Tonight, as Isom remains in the hospital, Mobile police detectives are searching for the shooter. I have prepared for this kind of situation my whole life. My parents are in the military. I was raising him. My husband did 12 years for this country. He had 12 years giving people like this the right to carry that gun he was shot with. The investigation is ongoing tonight if you know anything. You're asked to call Mobile Police. Live in Mobile tonight, Tyler Finger, Fox 10 News.